jar full. And is it full now? Yes. And how about now? Is the jar full now? Now, I want you to recognize that this jar represents your life. Golf balls are the important things, your family, your friends, your health, and your passions. The pebbles are the other important things, your car, your, your job, your home. The sand is everything else. It's just the small stuff. Now, if you put the sand in the jar first, you won't have room for the pebbles or the golf balls. The same is true in life. You spend all your energy and your time on the small stuff. You won't have time for all the really important things that matter to you. Pay attention to the things that are critical to your happiness. Take care of the golf balls first, the really important things. Set your priorities, because everything else is it's just sad. Yes. Uh, professor, what does, what does the beer represent? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. It goes to show that no matter how full your life may seem to be, there's always room for a couple of beers with a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Just open up your mind and listen to other people's opinions. That doesn't What's going on here? What's going on? John's being ridiculous. I'm being ridiculous. You're the one that's not Okay, boys, calm down. Okay, everybody take your seats. Matthew, John, come up here, please. John, stand over there and face that direction. Matthew, come over here and just do the opposite. Thank you. Okay, boys, turn around. John, what color is the ball? The ball's white. Seriously? Bro, do you just like making things difficult? Well, what color do you say the ball is? Black. The ball is black, clearly. I don't know what you see, Robert, but the ball is white. Without looking at the ball, I want you to both switch places. Can both of you please turn around. And what color is the ball now? Okay, please have a seat. Throughout our lives, we believe many things. We hold dear what we think is right and true. But at times, there'll be others who disagree with us. What we believe to be 100% right, they believe the opposite just as strongly. How can that? Can't they see? We will become frustrated, we might grow distant, we may even sever relationships entirely. Slow down. Breathe. Step into the other person's shoes and make all the difference. these things and you'll be the best person you can be. First, look at this pencil. We know that in order for it to become a useful pencil, that from time to time, again and again, it's going to have to go through a resharpening. Well, if this pencil could feel, we could imagine how painful that would be. But that's what it takes for it to be a useful pencil. Life is much the same. Painful experiences and challenges come to us all. But it is through these opportunities that we build character and we grow. Second is to keep in mind that we'll be able to correct many of the mistakes you make along the way, just like this eraser. So we can learn from our mistakes. They're not mistakes. They're lessons we can use to do better the next time around. And third, just like this pencil, any place where you are used, so to speak, you leave your mark, You're writing your own story. Think of stumbling blocks as stepping stones and never stop writing. And fourth, always remember the most important part of you is what's inside.